Hello, welcome to Ekidel. We are with Twin Future Civil and Structural Engineer. My name is Justice Umwaka and I am your instructor. Today, I will be showing you an automatic template for Start Through Connect. So, and the name of this template is called Stonebridge Template, as you can see it here. So, Stonebridge Template has added Start Through Detailing Template for um for the users that are using start pro and start pro connect other versions of stonebridge templates does not have um start pro templates they only power Prota structure and orion software but in this version of printed pro version of 6.147 they have added um start pro connect detail for um for the people using um the storm bridge and, and all that so right now let me now walk you through on what you are going to achieve by the end of your detailing if you're using um start pro connect so you'll be having um a seamless structural detailing of this kind of thing and also you'll be having a guide on how to perform your structural detailing as you can see for the people that have, that have been using storm bridge before they can testify of that so before I will go all the way down to what Stonebridge helps on enhancing the drawing that was done on Start Pro Connect, you will be seeing on all that. Now, if you're using LCDC of for Start Pro and all that, then this this video is best for you, and this template is perfectly best for you. Okay. So by the end of everything, you will be having um, this kind of um drawing as you can see that very standard and all that so let's now walk let me now walk you through on what you are going to achieve by the end of this video and if you're using um stonebridge stealing template you can check it out on google just type stonebridge um stealing template on google and then you can see more videos about stonebridge templates for people using start pro and also for the people using Prota structure software okay so right now let me just go on and then minimize this right now and then open it up on the start pro on the stonebridge template again okay? now once you purchase this stonebridge template following the link down below and you i think is on basically on discount price now so if you um, purchase this this um template following the link down below or go to google and type st uh, stone bridge templates you will see ekidel and all that as the first link that will appear on google search and all that then purchase that and then follow up what i'm going to teach you right now so using this right now the first thing you do is to once you open this um stone bridge template after purchased and then you will now come here and then click on what on this place that says start pro detail um detailing template here and then come here and then click on yes activate now once you click on that right now you hold on for it to open this um template on autocad so it works directly with autocad and any version of autocad works with autocad either autocad two and two thousand and above it works perfectly with any version of autocad so that should not be a barrier and it, and it also works perfectly with any version of start pro um software and all that okay so let's just hold on for that to um come up now okay so it's just coming up right now let's just hold on for that to come up so i'm coming up now as you can see that right now let's just hold on for it to display i know that it's trying to come up so i'll just um, maximize this right now maximize this autocad that just displayed right now so on display now let me just open up you can see it here right now that says um stonebridge template let, okay, let me just close it again back and then open it again for you guys to see how it opened in autocad okay so i'll close um these two template now this other one too should be closed i just say no don't save so i'll just minimize right now and then open up this right now so i open again right now on start pro here and i'll say yes so i'm saying yes now we'll hold on for it to open up on autocad and once it comes up then we will now begin to now copy um all our drawings that was done on start pro uh, um connect which is our lcdc and then begin to paste on the stone bridge template which is for the start pro in particular and then okay right now you cannot see that it does not come up like this so this is how it's meant to come up and then i'll just maximize this right now on this 
Now, I'm maximizing this right now, you can now see that this um, Storm Bridge template here, you can see that right now on, on that Start Pro. Um, so, let me just go back to Model View. Okay, it has um, a sample of drawing that you already have there, just like to give you a guide on what you are meant to achieve by the end of the uh, by the end of your structure daily and also how to arrange your structure daily because most people don't know how to arrange or what is uh, or most people don't know what they are meant to um or what a structural drawing is meant to contain so with the help of storm template you can be able to guide you on what to do and gives you a sample on how to detail um some of the structural element perfectly like this is for um for column as you can see right now this column is perfectly detailed and based on standard all over the world and also you can see the foundation layout and also you can also see that there is a general note here and also you can also see um the beam and floor yeah okay, this is the first floor beam and column layout i can see right now all the beams are titled and all that and everything and the slab thickness is also there and also you also see the slab detailing as you can see that the top bars and everything is still there the slab detailing and all that perfectly detailed as you can see that and also the reinforcement beam detail as you can see that right now also is also there so right now let me now walk you through on how, how to use this stop this um um stone bridge template in the place of start pro software okay so right now once you open the this um start pro template from stonebridge you will directly see it here on autocad here now on this place now i will now go to my desktop or where i saved my start pro um files so you can see that right now for the people using start pro software you know that this is how um, um start pro um rcdc um produce their drawings okay so right now i'll quickly start with any of that so i'll begin to paste each of these the beams the column the foundation the slab the beam and column layout the um slab section and staircase into the stone bridge template and then you will see how magical this is okay so right now i'll just quickly open this right now which is the slab section let me start from there okay so i will start from there right now and then you will see so basically right now for those people using start pro software you will know that this is how um start pro produce is structural detailing for slab section basically so this is for slab section now what all you just do the same step i will take now takes um follows up all the same steps that you would take okay so right now once you open up this start pro extracted drawing the next thing you do right now is to copy this start pro extracted drawing right click and then say copy just copy it directly right now so once you copy it now the next thing you do is to now go over and open up that stone bridge template for start pro and then once you open it paste it on this rectangle here so i'll quickly right click now and then go here and then paste so once i paste it now this this stone bridge template will help to optimize the drawing for for us so right now i'll just come here and then paste automatically you can see how the drawing has been optimized the test height has been set to standard and all that okay so let me just um navigate back to how it was on start pro okay so, so this was how it was let me just try to um make this view to have like a two view yeah let me just make this like this and um, make this like this just to you to see um, it very well okay that's fine and then i will now also put the that start pro okay i want to have it basically on two parts okay so, so let me just set that right now and set it very well okay let me just say that right now and make it to be on two parts so to make it to, to like be on two parts i'll just come here right now to windows and then say tie vertically and i'll just close the ones which i do not want to see right now or minimize them okay let me just minimize the ones i don't want to see i don't i was working on this slab so i'll just minim i was i was working on this slab basically so i'll just minimize this right now and then minimize this here um, or close this one entirely i don't want to see this close this or minimize it entirely and then i'll just tie this one vertically right now by this and then just do something like this uh, okay let me just 
take it this other way around and keep this here okay that's fine so i'll keep this here and then keep this here okay so this just to show you a clearer difference okay from what you are going to see right now and i'll keep this other one here and then this here okay that's fine so basically right now this is the one that's from start pro as you can see that right now if people that are very familiar with start pro okay this one is from start pro and this is the one from um that the storm bridge has just optimized that's that this is storm bridge start pro um staying template 2024 version so right now if i just copy again right now now look at it very well i copy again right now i click here and then come here and then say copy and i'll go over here right now come here let me just paste again let me just paste again right click here and then come here and then say um sorry come here and then say paste now immediately the thing appears directly here you can see that it is trying to optimize imme immediately in less than one minute it optimized all the joints that was there you can see right now so this is now the one that is being pasted here and this is the one before that was that came from start pro connect okay you can see a clearer difference so basically this so this template which is tom bridge helps to optimize or helps to reduce your workload that you are meant to perform during de de detailing to at least 80 percent and and then the remaining 20 percent is just for you to finish up and all that okay which you have already been given a guide on what you're meant to achieve and and then how to meant to uh, uh, arrange your drawings and all that you can see that so let me now go and open up other um drawings too from stonebridge so this is just for the slab um detailing okay for the sorry for the slab section which you have seen that right now so i will i will again close this other one right now and um, go and open up let me go again okay we have a staircase here so i'll open up staircase that came from start pro here and then on this right now i will just try to uh let me do to also tile it vertically also for you guys to see the difference okay so right now i'll copy this right this staircase right now from this um from this um um start pro over here I'm drawing into the stone bridge template here for start pro and then I'll come here right now and then copy this right now right click here and go here and then say copy and I'll just um, come here right now and then come to this place right click here and then paste okay now paste this here right now if I paste this here right now you can now see just on the clear without me pasting yet you can see how just for the stone bridge to just to just know that this drawing is coming from start pro um software it has now optimized it as you can see but so if i now go and paste it directly now you can now see how it is being optimized compared to what was here before okay now if you can print this directly that's from start pro you could see that your joints line weight text height and everything will not be to standard because basically for a good structural drawing the thickness of the line for for um for reinforcement is, is meant to be different from the concrete okay so that is what stone bridge helps to optimize and and so many things which i'll be mentioning so you cannot see this is the one that came from start pro as you can see that and this is the one that we just pasted on the um stone bridge template let me just repeat it again right now by just copying right now if i just go high right now then copy copy again just now by coming here copy and come here right now go here right click here and then say paste you can see that it is in it's just optimizing automatically and paste it here that's it right now okay so let, let me just go again and then open up again let me close again right now and open up let me say for the footing and foundation layout i'll say no don't save okay i'm gonna open up right now for the footing and foundation let me see your foundations here i've done for that for the two I'll now go again and open for the footing correctly right now. So this is now your footing, okay? You can see that we'll have several footing here. I can quickly copy one or two or three. And let me, okay, let, me, let me just copy either this four here, okay? I can co copy this four right now and then copy it. Let me just first of all, um, tile it first. So I didn't do that very perfectly well. Um, tile again, okay, that's fine so i will tile again right now and copy this let me just copy again i can choose the copy either for or a, a kid yeah this is okay copy this right now so just copy your drawing from the start pro detail into the stone bridge here come here um, give a space a bit always put it on the rectangle here okay 
and then right click here and then come here and then say paste here and if i paste this particular one here right now you will see that there will be a big difference you can see it perfectly it changes automatically not in, in less than few seconds compared to what was here you can see that so if you can print this one directly from start pro you see that your joints will be messed up it will be messed up so what happened is that stonebridge helps to give your structural detailing um a good standard okay a good standard of how joints are meant to be you can see that right now so you cannot see how your joints have not been optimized compared to what was here before from Stonebridge. You can see that. So you can see how it is optimized perfectly. Let me do that again. Right? You can see that everything is have everything has been optimized. Even if there are one thousand pieces, it will optimize it automatically, and then it has reduced your workload for your test height, for your test scale, and also it works with scale. It has also you use the scale and all that to what it's meant to be okay so it has worked perfectly for you okay and all that okay let me just walk it through again right now so just copy your drawing let me just copy this right now if i copy this right now from here and just copy and then come here right now come here zoom in here and then paste come here and then say paste here you can see how your drawings is just optimized right now you can see that compared to what was here before as you can see that perfectly so you can see how stone bridge works perfectly to optimize your drawing this is basically for start pro users okay so it also has other templates for Prota structure software which i have done a lot of video you can watch my video about stone bridge template in terms of Prota structure okay and then also you can also let me, let me now also on this other one now this is now the um foundation layout you can see that right now so if i go ahead now and copy this foundation layout now from start pro here and then from start pro drawing here and then come over here let me just give a space see on see on that see on this um rectangle come here right click here right click here and then come here and then say paste here you can see that it has now optimized compared to what was here before you can compare this drawing here to this okay so by the time you follow up everything this is how your foundation layout is meant to achieve um, you're meant to achieve it so this is what stonebridge says you're meant to achieve your structural um drawing for foundation layout as you can see that so basically right now you cannot see that it has already reduced your workload so because once we paste the drawing let me just paste again right click here and then come here and then um, paste you can see that right now paste everything is changing so if also once you come here right click here come here just copy um copy here copy here and then come to stonebridge templates here and then paste it here um come here and then paste here okay that's fine it changes automatically like I see right now okay so let me now go and walk you through again to um come here close this one here and then walk you through again let me show we we have done staircase slab and foundation let's now walk you through on the let's like okay, let's use this other one slab be my layout here and open again right now come here again right now and say tie vertically and then let me use it okay that's fine so this is for the stone bridge and this is for start pro so i'll come here right this came from start pro here i'll copy again right now copy this from here copy directly here and then come all the way down to this stone bridge here still on this box here come here right click here and then come here and then say paste here you see how everything will change right now paste everything changed automatically compared to what was here before so you can see that so you can see how stone bridge works perfectly and all that so by the end of everything using the stone bridge template this is what you are going to achieve for beam and colon layer so this is how your beam and colon layer is going to be achieved and all that why you work on that okay so again let me now walk you through again right now on the close this one on the let me go and choose the beam okay that's the beam the beams now and then you cannot see your beams here directly i'll just tile again vertically to see the two and then this is for the stone bridge and all that okay and then let me now walk away again right now if i go again and then copy this right now copy this entirely now copy all the beams here and then come to this place right click here and then come here paste right now okay you cannot see how your beams have been optimized 
as you can see that right now compared to what was here before i can see that right now this is from this um from start pro this is from stonebridge i can see that this is from stonebridge you can see how it has optimized all your drawings all your drawings have been optimized you can see that right now and all the test heights and everything are to standard so once you print out this drawing you will see that your drawings will be to standard so though you still have much some works to do but it has helped to reduce your workload to at least 80 percent as you can see what was here before i can also see this one right now you can see what is now the drawing how um is now being produced you can see that right now okay you can see that compared to what was here before okay you can see the difference right now so by the end of everything you are going to achieve something like as a sample so that's why there's a sample for you this is what you're going to achieve for your beam so you just take off the things which are not necessary for so on 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 those place on your beam looking at what you have on the sample from stonebridge how your beams drawings are meant to look like okay so again i'll close this again right now for the beams and open for the column and then for the column here this is for the column i'll open for the column right now and for the column again right now i'll now also tie vertically here to see the two of them so this is the Stonebridge um, template for Start Pro, and then this is the drawing that came from Start from Start Pro. So I'll just quickly I can choose to copy all the column here at once. Copy copy all your drawings from there, and then right click and then say copy. Okay, and then walk then through right now into the Stonebridge template here. Zoom in on the rectangle, right click, and then come here and then do what paste here right now. So if I paste this right right now, you can see that there will be a let me just wait on for it to change. Okay, you can see the deep the, the big difference right now compared to what was here before. Okay, although you still have some works to do because you are meant to you can see what is here before right now from the stone from the um start pro coming from start pro into the storm bridge you can see that there's a big difference as you can see that just now okay although you still have some works to do because this is how um storm bridge expects your columns to be by the end of everything so this is the sample of your column and all that i have done column detailing using this storm bridge template you can go and watch my videos on that and all that so if you want this template check the link down below and download that so now let me just show the picture so we are done with start pro currently for this version of stonebridge 2024 so let me just close right now and then go and work with um ah, so i am done with start pro. you can now see that all our drawings right now has been pasted starting from the section you can see how the section is right now perfectly cleaned up okay for slab section and also for your staircase perfectly cleaned up to standard as you can see that and then um for beams it's also cleaned up although you still have some some less work to do and all that and then this is for your part footing perfectly cleaned up too as you can see right now perfectly cleaned up as you can see that and then um for which again this is for your foundation layer this you have some works to do so you can quickly look at what um, stonebridge has for you and then do your drawing in relation to this and all that and get it exactly the same way as stonebridge has gotten it following all the layers that have been set. But these layers have been set to structural standard globally to, so that whenever you print anywhere in the world it will appear standard drawing okay so most young engineers don't know how to um produce such a drawings perfectly and that has been an issue most times a good design and a poor detailing can collapse a structure okay so stonebridge is is in in is, is, is in a goal to making structural detailing easy simple and stress-free so that's their mission to make structural detailing easy simple and stress-free okay so right now i will now walk you through using the start pool software with the same with this stone bridge so basically it's so um sorry put a structure so if you're using put structure so i am done with this stone bridge basically so for those people so, so sorry i'm done with the start rule so for those people working with start rule you have you have seen how the stone bridge has optimized your drawing perfectly okay so right now i'll quickly go and then close up the start pro template okay so i'm um, so you can quickly save another but i will not save because i'm not working on this so i will just cancel right now and they say no okay 
and then for the people using um uh, so i'm quickly working on this um slab detailing basically for um for for a car park okay you can see that right now so i i'm using this tomb bridge template basically to work on that as you can see i have so many i have done for the beams and all that although this design was done using um start um, using them um, put structure so you can see how my beams have appeared perfectly when i use um stone bridge template in relation to protaster software so you can see that my beams are perfectly and all that so i have arranged this is this is a wonderful design basically is um a four story car park okay so you can see how it is done perfectly i use this this the stone bridge template for that okay as you can see that the stone bridge template for that i use that so let me now walk you through for the people using um protar structure how you can achieve your perfect detailing for beam just like this compared to what um compared to um what um protar structure gives you okay so right now i'll go i'll just minimize this right now and then on minimizing that right now you will now see the stone bridge template so i will just explain this stone bridge template here for you guys if you're new on ekidel so this area this section of stone bridge is basically for the people using protar structure software i have already used the particular one here for start pro um software and this one here is for cac which is which people are using orion software which i have done before and it came out perfectly so right now this ones right now are the ones people using Prota structure software which i used perfectly for this structural detailing of this four story building car park okay so this is basically for this all these joints are we, we are produced using Prota structure for the people that uses this sort of area you, you should know that this is um beam um beam detail from Prota structure as you can see that so it's basically a massive structure i can see my slab detailing basically so although currently right now i am trying to implement the um this ramp void because there's a ramp here that the those cars are going to flow on so there's a ramp here so i'm going to implement that on this place here okay that's why you're seeing me implementing that okay i didn't i didn't do that before when i was doing the this slab detailing so i'll just um finish up that and then come back and change this other one here okay although this was this this, this is a personal project actually you can see my inclined beams and all that for the ramp and all that for that for the beams around the ramp area and you can see that also how the cars are going to flow so right now let me just go and walk you through right now for the people using um start for okay sorry um product structure okay so right now on this storm bridge template here if you are a user of Prota structure now i advise also even if you're not a user of Prota structure this particular section of templates comprises cut across structural engineering as a whole so as a good structural engineer what makes you um good is when you have several templates for your work okay so when you have several templates for your work it makes your work seamless and easy okay so right now you can see that this area is basically built for Prota structure this is that one here for Prota structure but in spite of that you can see that it has several templates so i would advise people also using etabs can also use this as templates even start to also because you can see that they also have pi here they can also take this also as a as, as what a template because it gives you if i open up a pi right now imagine that someone that have not done a pi detailing before now got this template with this template you will be able to know how to detail or how to perform a perfect structural detailing for pi foundation let me hold on for that okay right now i can now see that this is the pi if i now go on and then maximize this right now you will now see that this is a perfect structural detailing for pi foundation you can see that this is stone bridge template join so this is now a sample from stone bridge telling you that this is how you are meant to arrange and perform your structural detailing in terms of pi so this is basically a pi layout as you can see how it's neat showing the um the showing the ground beam connecting beam with the pi showing the pi cap several pi caps with the with the column name and the pi cap type 
can see that this is the pie layout and then when it comes for the pie cap detailing oh this is so wonderful can i see also that this is now the concrete section of the of the pie for four pies you can see how it is done perfectly and then this is now the reinforcement detailing of these four pies you can see how it is shown perfectly and also for the cutting of the section you can see how you're going to see very perfect how the reinforcement are being placed and everything oh this is so wonderful and also you can also see the you can also see the chair reinforcement which is the chair bench reinforcement which is going to be on this pie cap you can see that and then also the bending radius of how they're going to bend their way so this stone bridge gives you standard detailing globally of how your drawings is meant to look like so even if you're not a user of Pota structure but you are a structural engineer that want to go ahead and that want to move your career forward and draw standard drawings and produce correct and detailing then you need this stone bridge template okay so why i just go all the way down now let me now walk you through how this stone bridge template works perfectly with what with um with protester software okay so right now i'll just close this one right now and all that so before working with Potter structure so you, you using this template to work with Potter structure the first thing you must have, you must identify is on your building on Potter structure what type of building did, did you design and what is the foundation of that building because, because this stone bridge template working with Potter structure works with based on templates on foundations okay so right now if i did if i go to my um navigate to my Pota structure folder right now any of that 2018 version or, or any of that basically stone bridge template works for all versions of autocad and for all versions of Pota structure and for all versions of start pro and for all versions of orion so it it is not like because it's 2024 then it will work for no no it works for all versions okay so right now once i open my Pota structure um um uh, project folder let me just locate on any of the projects which i have done before let me just work uh, i think i have done we have done this completely let me just work on that um this um 2018 version let me see two story um, wait, so let, me, let, me, let me see this if i have a join on this okay no drawing on this yet let me just open i want to open a drawing where i have okay let me see this yes i think this is for duplex yeah i've done yeah let me see yeah drawings okay so once i open up a drawing now on this now okay yes i have drawing on this so this is drawing from what from um Pota structure so once you open up your drawing from Pota structure you and i will do that Product structure is a good software in terms of design, but when it comes to detailing, they have not yet perfected their works on detailing. So what you just do, with the help of Stonebridge templates, it makes your work perfectly and seamless, um, stress-free on detailing. Okay. So what you just do right now is to do what is to copy your drawing. First of all, before you copy, look at the type of foundation that was used. You can see that this is you. This is a part foundation so when i go back to stonebridge template here what i'll do is to open the template for pad foundation i can see right now this is template for pad foundation okay so i'll open this right now and say yes open so once it opens up right now the next thing i'll do is to copy my structural detail that came from Potter structure into the stonebridge template based on pad foundation okay and then you will see how all your joints are going to transform perfectly just as the one i showed you for the for the um project i was working on perfectly so let me just hold on for that to um open up okay let's hold on for that to open up right now so right now you can now see this is now um the stone bridge template for for what for part for um part foundation and then you will not see let me just maximize this right now maximize this and then maximize this now here okay so once you open this right now you can see that stone bridge template for part footing okay 
So once this opens right now, the next, the first thing you see is to see this rectangle icon here. This is where you're meant to paste your drawing. And then this is now a sample from Stonebridge of how you are meant to arrange and prepare your structural drawing. So Stonebridge requires their mission is to make sure you produce a good structural drawing that can be accepted anywhere in the world. Depending, even if there isn't different kind of codes, it will work perfectly. Okay. So this, this is why this sample is here for as a guide for how you're meant to arrange your drawing, starting from the foundation layout, column, okay, footings, column, column, and all that. Okay. So right now, once you open up this right now, the first thing to do is to go and open up. So I'll just go again right now and same way I did for start pro and tile it this way and then to see let me just move this all the way down this is from total structure and this is the start pro here so this is the stone bridge i don't know why i said start pro okay maybe i did start pro just video right now so i'll just come here right now and then keep this okay so this is now from uh from stone bridge here as i said that stone bridge company structure identity template for part footing okay 24 version so this is now as you can see right now so what you just do right now is to copy your drawings right now copy all your drawings that came from portal structure here copy it perfectly let me just copy that right now copy it perfectly right now and then copy it right click here and then say copy so once i copy that right now i will come over to this place here that says stone bridge template here okay click on that zoom in this rectangle here right click here and then come here and then do what paste here okay so once i paste this right now once i paste this here right now and i'll just go and paste this here and paste this here okay and paste so hold on for for some less than one minute for you to now transform your drawing to standard okay so right now you can now see how your drawings has now been transformed compared to what was here this is for the foundation layout as you can see that now look at how the drawing was here and look at how the drawing is being transformed let's now go on to the beams for the beams for this other one here from from product structure here this is the one that is on the stone bridge template okay so once you come here right now you can now see the difference here see the difference here right now and see the difference here again right now so once you come here to now get exactly what the stone bridge says you're going to get here for beams as you can see right now the have beam is you can see the layer that, that that is here what you now do right now is to come here click on one of the beam dimension here okay let me just maximize this right now maximize this right click on it and then just click, sorry, just click on it yes right click on it and then you will see what you will see um select, select, select similar everything now will be selected as you can see right now then type ch enter and then come to the this place that will show the dollar boss here around this place let me just hold on for that to show okay on this place right now Click on this place that says dim style come here now everything will change now automatically and select what ng 50 come here and choose this one that says um ng 50 here dim 50 and hold on for it to change in less than one minute everything will change automatically to what you can perfectly can you see that right now everything now has not changed you can see that right now so you cannot see the pure difference this is what let me just tile again tile again vertically so you cannot see the pure difference as you can see that right now let me just tile again right now take this over to here and over to here okay so you cannot see that uh, this is the one that came from portal structure here compared to the one that came from what start from a um, stone bridge template i don't know why i'm saying start pro okay sorry for that so this is now the one that came from portal structure the beam you can see if you can print this out you see that you're, you you have a messed up drawing okay your drawing will mess up because everything will be we will, will just be of, of the same line weight okay which is not good for a structural drawing to be now you can see the one that came from portal struck um, from um from um, that you just put it from stone bridge template yeah? all the beams has been optimized okay both the floor beams and also the um the roof beams okay everything is optimized so if, if you like have up to 100 beams everything will change that was how i was able to achieve this particular drawing for this you can see that i was able to achieve this drawing because once i paste all my joints all the beams 
all the flaws from story one down everything optimized so this was how i was able to achieve that now you can now see the reason how uh, and this and it helps to lessen your workload to at least 80 percent okay the workload that spent on drawing to 80 percent can now see how it is so you can now see that this my drawing now as you can see right now it is same drawing that we have when we come to this place here okay it's same thing it so it helps to optimize your drawing as long as it is coming from what from proto structure you can see everything is optimized okay let me just tile again right now tile again vertically okay you can now see even if i still copy one of the beams again right now and let me let me just copy one, one of this again let me just copy let me okay let me, let me just take this right now copy this again right now copy this again right click here and then say copy here and then come here to stone bridge templates and then come here and paste it you will see how it also change this, this is just a repeat what i just did before paste it here come here click on this right click here and then say what's less similar similar and then come here right now ch enter and then come here under dim style and then come here and choose what and dim 50 okay this was set from uh, from uh, from from uh, stormy templates and then you will see how everything will turn right now you see how to turn here just put your eye here to turn here in less than one minute everything will turn just hold on for your wife to turn okay perfectly okay that's fine so right now you cannot see how everything has turned you cannot see how it has turned so from this being right now compared to what was here before you can see that there is a big difference okay so you can see how stone bridge helps you to optimize your drawing okay the reason why we brought this here on ekidel because ekidel mission also is to help to lessen um to help structural engineers to build their career okay so why stone bridge is helping to lessen the stress which I meant to spend on structural detailing we here on Ekidel is here to help structural engineers and also civil engineers to build their career okay so you cannot see how stone bridge template works perfectly it also works on all you can if i also open on beam on raft foundation you can also see it has all it also has templates on beam on raft foundation let me just open let it let that just open right now also have a, beam, uh, a template on steel detailing also uh, that's so amazing so if you want this template you can check it down below it also has a bar bending schedule okay i have done videos on this you can watch on that so i'll i'll just pause this right now and just because of to reduce the video, uh, this video duration and then just okay so right now you can you can get this template down below this the, the, this video description or you go directly on google and then you will search on stonebridge template and then you will see the list and then you can click on the first or the second link and all that and then purchase this template it, 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 it is not free and also it is not also expensive is is i think it's less than 22 dollars and all that so i think that is not really expensive for that but it helps your work perfect because it has almost all the templates in structural detailing okay so it helps you and all that okay let me just hold on let me just that's, that's already open for okay this is now for um this is now the template for um for let me let, let me let me make it bigger for um beam wrap foundation as you can see it gives you a standard may um drawing you can see that this is drawing for beam raft you can see that and then also let me just hold on for that to load okay you can also see the 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 section of the raft foundation as you can see right now and also for the beams you can see that right now and then move on to the slab which is the slab raft you can see that right now and also the section of the slab you can see how it is being connected from the toe slab to the beam and then to the slab okay perfectly you can see your joints this, 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 these are the beams this is so oh, wonderful oh so much is good so you can also see your column joints okay how it is meant to look like so this is like a template like a go by because you cannot I, I, okay well I, I, let, let me just stop that right now so even if you want this video right now if you want this template check the link down below and download that or um, purchase that or go to google and search for storm bridge template and then you can purchase that okay ekidel is purely a paid partner to stone to stone bridge company so that's why we are making much video and we have much video on youtube Com compared to other channels that have um stone bridge that, that, that also selling um stone bridge template so ekidel is a paid is the first paid partner and all that
So, and also if you have any issues on Stormbridge template, provided you purchased it directly from Ekidel here, we will guide you on that, on how to get that. But if you purchase it from other vendors and then we might not able to get because we, we, we will have to call, um, check your email address if that is, if, if, if your email is being purchased from, um, um, from Ekidel, um, interface and all that. So basically, if you want that, check it down below and if you find this video very very useful i would say you should click on the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up because ekidel needs your like and, uh, and also share this video to your friends and colleagues and also recommend ekidel to your friends and colleagues they know what we are doing here on ekidel okay so bye for now and then see you again next time this time next week tomorrow bye then bye for now